This Harbor Freight parking lot sale is a mechanic's dream. Page one, pick up some deep wall or deep well type sockets. It's this set, it's the 13 piece. So you get everything from 7 16 all the way up to inch and a quarter, which I think I've only used once or twice, but you have it just in case. I've had zero issues with any of the Pittsburgh impact rated sockets. The impact, they're the thicker wall and just the heavier duty type sockets. As no surprise to anyone, Harbor Freight's got a parking lot sale right around the corner. For this list, I've got mechanic tools. Now a guaranteed must have would be a floor jack or lift jack. Now, here's my take on floor jacks. They have a very big range of different floor jacks that you can pick up. This one's great for me. It's the smaller aluminum one, half, one and a half ton. So it's perfect for my smaller car. If I were to be working on the bigger one, I need probably the two or three ton, even the cheap Pittsburgh, they're awesome. So pick up just any that will fit your needs. You can get early access if you're an ITC or Inside Track Club member. Here's my two cents with this. If there is a certain item, let's just say like a sweet icon set or ratchet that you are dying to have that you may be worried that they run out, sure, go get the membership, if not, then it's not worth it just for this sale. I would actually wait until they open it up for those big ticket items, or lots of times they'll put a higher percentage off coupon for ITC members. Of course, I can't go a full video without mentioning welders. If you are stepping it up and getting into maybe auto body work or actually framework type stuff, that Omni Pro 220 is an awesome welder. This is one of the best deals that you will see all year round. I am definitely just a DIY mechanic. I've got my tools scattered all over up on the pegboards. I've heard good things about the US General, so this might just be one of those sales where I become a true mechanic and get my own toolbox. The cheap items, you're for sure gonna want to pick these up. I've got the magnetic trays. They are awesome for all of your bolts. And then of course, I use and abuse these. I, I pick them up all the time. I've broken a bunch of them, but that's okay. It's a buck 50. These are the Hex socket adapters cheap enough to pick up two or three of them if you are brand new or just wanting to get into the game a complete mechanic set is well worth it yeah you got you know 50 of those pieces are just like allen wrenches that you're never going to use this thing not even on sale is worth picking up they've got multiple 10 millimeter sockets impact swivel deep quarter inch and three eighths just waiting to be lost even though, yes, I've had, you know, the ball joint service kits and it works, those are the specialty tools that are just a step above just your average oil change or tile rotation. I guess you can wobble a wobbled wobble? It's a socket extension set, except that these guys have a little chamfered edge on here, just so then it gives you that very slight angle, if needed, for those hard to reach bolts. The one that I've actually probably used the most is this nice longer quarter inch one. $5.99 for a combination wrench set. Who cares if it's the cheapest one on the market? Pick up both the SAE and the metric. This page is loaded with compressors. Here's my take. If you want to get an air impact or pneumatic impact wrench, you're gonna need an air compressor. Skip those smaller ones, those little two and three gallon ones. Even though they can get high PSI, they don't have enough air capacity to pump a whole bunch of air through these guys. So those smaller ones keep for the brad nailers and just the little tiny airbrush, that kind of stuff. Those McGraws I'm eyeing all the time just because I'm just waiting for my central pneumatic to finally bite the bullet so I can get another one, but it's still kicking. Earlier, I forgot to mention the storage bins. I love these ones because you can actually take out the little bins. You can move them around, do whatever. They're perfect for bolts, bits, whatever you need. Earthquake has an awesome impact range of impact drivers. Now, just like with lift jacks, they have tons of them and each one's kind of tailored a little differently. Yes, they got smaller or shorter ones. I go with half inch and that's because I use the air impact for my higher torque type stuff. I like the actual socket for these ones because I'll tend to be using my impact sockets with this 
You working on diesels? Well sure, pick up the three quarter inch socket and twist your nuts right off. Have I mentioned welders yet? This is not the best deal that you'll see the Chicago Electric go for, and nor would I suggest getting this one for auto body type stuff, but it can do 316 brackets without an issue. The mini pen light, I love this. They've got the one on sale is the rechargeable one. To each their own, if you don't mind having to remember to recharge it, get that one. Me, I don't mind throwing in batteries. This will be the cheapest screwdriver set that you will own. They're like throwaway screwdrivers. Less than 10 bucks for this full set? Yep, it's worth it. Or pick it up to have on hand when you need to make that specialty tool. The brushes, gloves, even the marker, which this is a freaking amazing marker. I, I actually use this more than a Sharpie now. Who would have thought Harbor Freight would come out with an awesome marker? I'd pick up everything on that bottom shelf except for that rotary tool. I'm DIY Pro. We'll see you next time.